What's up guys? Third vlog, Walt's Think Tank. Last one did it a lot better than I was expecting. So we're back in downtown Disney today, getting our weekly fix in. We're gonna see what's going on. See all the new Christmas decorations they just put up. So should be a good day. It's so pretty down here in like the main shopping area. It's you got trees on trees on trees. Oh man, this is so awesome. Normal drill. We're gonna go to the back lot, see what's cooking, see what Mickey's got new for us. Hopefully it's something. We'll see you guys in there. Woo, back lot shop time. Did a similar thing last week, but I genuinely think I'm not gonna find anything new. Um, but hey, we'll see what happens. Just beyond that door is Hollywood Land. I won't get to walk that on Thursday. Actually, I won't be here on Thursday. I'll be here on Monday though. Hopefully less crowds, but still probably a lot of people. It's a trash can from Hollywood Land. Wow, amazing. New stuff, I found some new stuff. Good stuff. Some Christmas spirit jersey looking masks. Running for 13 bucks, okay. That's pretty decent. All right, guys, hear me out. Really like that. That sequence, like green? I think it's pretty snazzy. Look, at, just like I predicted last week, the vinyl partner statues from that exclusive shopping experience are here at the back lot. Uh, I don't see the popcorn bucket, but yeah, at least you got two of the three exclusive items out here. Guess who's back? Pack again. Sorry guys, that's actually the first time we like legit haven't had much in terms of merch updates. So yeah, <laughs> hopefully World of Disney has something new. Good look at what I now know is called Garling, hanging off the Five and Dime and up there at the monorail bridge. Whew. Only got two more days. Well for me five more because I'll be there on Monday. But for the rest of you, Two more days. So when Buena Vista Street opens, what are you guys gonna do first? I think I'm gonna get some grub. I miss some Buena Vista Street grub, especially Carte Circle. That place was, mm. But yeah, let me know down in the comments what you guys would do first when Buena Vista Street opens on Thursday. So now we are at Black Tap, and I'm actually gonna remember to do a real food review. Um, and we actually ordered real food this time, not just a side of fries and a milkshake, so. So we got a vegan Nashville pot. We got fried pickles, and Evan got some onion rings. So let's, let's see this unboxing. Let's see how it looks. Woo! That looks vegan. Really vegan, yeah. Let's see these pickles, see how fried they look. Oh, and those are fried. Let's see how the onion rings look. Yo, those are big boys. <laughs> Dang, okay. We got some big rings. So this was exponentially hotter than I thought it was gonna be. Um, from like a one to 10 on the spicy, I was about an eight. Uh, that gave me the sniffles. What do you think, Brina? Nah, if you don't like spice, this is not it. But yeah. like on the vegan aspect, it's pretty decent, yeah. So unless you're a spice person, 
I, I don't think I could recommend that. That was quite painful. But hey, fried pickles, demolished. Onion rings, one left. All these Christmas decorations out here are just absolutely lovely at night. Wow, this is amazing, guys. Each one of these displays is just jam-packed with Christmas trees and Christmas lights. Ooh, really getting in the Christmas spirit now. Sorry guys, there like genuinely is no new merch at like any of the stores. But not a total loss. Any day downtown Disney is a great day. So yeah, we'll keep exploring. Hopefully we find something new at World of Disney. So OC's back in the purple, and it took me about 13 minutes, uh, start with the extended queue, to get into the world of Disney. So like I mentioned earlier, all the overflow from those exclusive shopping experiences do end up here at the world of Disney. This is the popcorn box I was talking about. Now we're back in the purple. Um, all shopping has been reduced to 25% capacity, so right now it is like dead empty in here. It's also a Tuesday night. So that could be a part, but I mean, 25%, look at this. There's just very few people compared to last week when I was here. Look at that right here. Got some Minnie Mouse bow masks. Look at them. I think those look bountiful. I mean, I could never pull off these colors, but I'm really digging these retro vibes down here. Look at, here we go, getting low. Retro. Kylo Ren's new EP, we got songs like, I don't know if I have the strength to do it, uh, Dad, and Thank You. I know you guys can't tell, but in here, it feels really muggy. <laughs> in the Jazz Kitchen Express, ready to pick up some Ben Yeezys. I love a good Ben Yeezy because if you breathe in too soon from all the excitement, you like choke a little and you kind of die. It's always fun. It's always good when you can sort of die when you're eating. So that concludes today's vlog. I uh, tried to do my best to try to find new stuff to show you guys, but not a lot was, not a lot was too new. So yeah, next week we'll definitely have some new stuff because uh, Buena Vista Street will be open. So. That should be a very long and hefty vlog. See you guys next week. Take it easy.